Hey there, I'm Shannon. Welcome to my channel. I am doing my October favorites today. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and jump right in. My list for this video is definitely a very random assortment of things. So hopefully I don't jump too much. I'll try to keep things in categories as much as possible. Okay, so first I'll do like beauty, makeup, skincare, that kind of thing first. For skincare, something I've been absolutely loving through the month of October is my Murad Daily Cleansing Foam. Um, I have been using Murad products for a while now, but this is my first time using the Daily Cleansing Foam. The Daily Cleansing Foam is really good if you have any pore congestion, um, if you feel like you've got blackheads or anything like that, or if you have oilier skin that can be pore clogging. I've got combination skin, so I struggle to find product that doesn't over dry too much but clears away the oil so I definitely feel like this does the trick but yeah I've been really loving this through the month of October and I feel like I can see a change in my skin. Next is a hair product it is the It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In product. Um, I have known about this product for a while and I actually picked this up quite a few months ago however it got shoved behind a bunch of my other products and I kind of forgot about it and then in October I found it hiding behind a bunch of other products and dug it back out and I have been loving it so much. The 10 things that it says it does on the back are repairs dry damaged hair, adds shine, detangles, controls frizz, seals and protects hair, prevents split ends, stops hair breakage, creates silkiness, enhances natural body in flat iron spray and thermal protection. I definitely recommend um, picking this up. I just spray on my hair when I get out of the shower before I brush it out. It's a miracle product like it says. Next moving on to makeup it is the Benefit Their Real Tinted Primer. So like it says this is a lash tint as well as a primer. You put this on before your mascara if you want to give your lashes a little bit of a boost but also since it's tinted you can just wear it on its own. Because I am naturally like a redhead strawberry blonde I have very very light lashes. If I feel like I want to have a lighter makeup day instead of going for a mascara I'll go for the tinted primer um, as a substitute just to give it a little bit of color but it leaves your lashes still very soft and flexible without giving it that kind of like sticky hard feeling of a mascara and I feel like sometimes if you over wear mascara it really breaks your lashes so I use this instead on the days where I don't want to do a full face of makeup. Lastly for beauty products it is my NYX soft matte lip cream and it is in the color Copenhagen and I have been loving this color for fall. It's a super deep dark purple. I think it's just a really good color for me. I wore this in two videos ago when I was talking about my favorite Halloween movies so if you want to see what this looks like on my lips go check out that video. I guess this would kind of count as beauty as well. It is my ever beloved scrunchie. There is not a day that goes by that I do not use this scrunchie. It's just perfect for throwing my hair up to get it out of my face. Plus, I love it because it's not as harsh as a rubber band. It's super 90s looking, first of all. It's a scrunchie, but it's also tie-dye. I am obsessed. That was such a fail. Next, I'll move on to more of entertainment type things. First on that list for October would be Niall Horan's new album, Flickr. This came out midway through October, I think. I'm a One Direction fan, so it's no surprise that I like Niall's album. But yeah, it's just a very chill album. Just love to throw it on and relax too. And then next is a movie. This isn't a movie I just discovered in October, to be fair. I've loved this movie for years. But I went on a random spree of like watching it back to back to back in October and I do that with movies like I'll just get attached to it and just like loop it and it is Dirty Dancing so it's not even like a specific October movie. It's not Halloween themed or anything like that. If you've never seen Dirty Dancing, oh my god, go see it. Get it. Find it on Apple TV, Roku, something. Just go watch it. You'll thank me. Two other entertainment things that I've been loving this month. First, Riverdale. Riverdale came back and I'm so excited. I absolutely loved the first season and the second season is not disappointing either. I've been loving it. I think the cast of Riverdale is great. I think the writing is funny. It's just such a creative idea. I loved the Archie comics when I was younger. But yes, two thumbs up for Riverdale. The other show that I'm currently loving and binging on Netflix like no other binge has ever been binged before is Criminal Minds. 
I feel like that sounds so weird to say, but I love like murder mysteries and true crime and everything like that. However, I will warn you that some of them can be extremely creepy. So if you get creeped out or scared easily, Criminal Minds may not be the one for you. And then last on the like entertainment spectrum is another YouTuber that I've been binging as well. When I'm not watching Criminal Minds, I'm probably watching her videos and that is Ashley Brooke. She is in her late twenties, lives in New York with her boyfriend. She posts a lot of fashion videos, which I absolutely love her style. I think she's so good at styling outfits and giving tips. So if you need style tips, go check out Ashley's page. And then I also love her weekly vlogs that she does as well. I think she's super underrated to be honest. And then lastly are just a couple of fashion items to include. The first one are my new Nike shoes. Absolutely obsessed. I have been wearing these nonstop when I go to work out, when I go to run errands. Like these are just like my throw on go-to shoes at the moment. I absolutely love them. And last but certainly not least is my beret it's this cute little red beret i got it from forever 21 i absolutely love these for fall first of all i love the color of it red is super in right now love the red trend for fall and i just think berets are super cute all i need is for leo to paint me like one of his french girls because i know leonardo dicaprio is watching this right now hi he's a big fan of mine but yeah loving the beret those are all of my October favorites. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you've been loving the past few months um, down in the comment section. Also, go ahead and hit the little like button if you enjoyed this video and subscribe to my channel if you wanna see more from me. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.